Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of In the Kitchen with Sandy. And on today's episode, I am going to be making some delicious garlic shrimp. Um, everybody in this house loves shrimp, except for one person. And um, I'm making a ton of it today because it is that good. So what I have here is um, shrimp that I got at my local grocery store and it's already been deveined and peeled. I just went ahead and just um, ran some cold water over it just to, you know, give it a, a quick washing. And we are going to use about um, a teaspoon of garlic powder, um, about a teaspoon of paprika, some olive oil, and um, about two and a half tablespoons of butter. You do not have to melt this butter. I just got ahead of myself and because I have a whole lot of recipes going on today and I just popped it in the microwave. so. You don't have to melt it, but if you want to melt it, go ahead. No big deal. And in this, I've got about um, three cloves of just finely chopped garlic, some kosher salt, some fresh ground pepper, and just a pinch of red pepper flakes. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go over the stove and get started. Okay, to my um, pan, I've got it on about medium, medium high heat, um, slightly under high. I'm going to add um, about two tablespoons of olive oil, and we are going to add our butter. Get in there, and then once this heats up just a little bit, swirl it around there. We're going to add our garlic. You can go ahead and add your garlic now. You don't have to wait till it heats up because you want your um, oil infused with the garlic. So, it's gonna be good. Alrighty. And then we are going to add our, we're gonna use about a teaspoon of garlic powder. That's a teaspoon of onions. And then once this gets started, if it ever gets started, okay. Um, we're gonna go ahead and add our shrimp. So we're just going to cook this around oh, for about a minute or two. Mmm, it already smells delicious. It smells so good. It's going to be amazing. Trust me. Okay, we've got our shrimp in there. We're going to jack this temperature up just a little bit to get it started. And what you're going to do is you're just going to um, toss it and just keep tossing it back and forth. Not back and forth, but you know what I mean. Give it a quick stir and it's just going to start to develop a beautiful pink color. And it only takes just a, a few minutes to cook. You don't want to overcook it because it kind of gets kind of rubbery. So we're just going to go ahead and let that uh, fry up for just a couple minutes. Okay, uh, my shrimp has started to um, cook finely. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a couple pinches of the kosher salt. It's delicious, delicious. Fresh ground pepper. You don't have to do a whole lot of the ground pepper because we do have the red pepper flakes there. That's going to give it just a slight kick. We like slight kicks. Mm -mm. Just a couple pinches. You don't have to do a lot unless you want a lot. However much heat you want, go ahead and use it. And I'm going to use about a teaspoon of the um, paprika. I had to make sure that's what that was, paprika. Oh, they would have killed me if I'd put that much um, cayenne pepper in there. It would have been amazing, but they killed me. Okay, we're going to give this a stir, and we're going to continue to cook this until it um, all the colors are coming on the shrimp. Look at that. It's already starting to turn nice and pink, and look at that. See, I told you that you could use this over noodles or rice or something. You're going to have that delicious broth in there, buttery um, olive oil and garlic infused broth and that would be simply amazing poured over um, some nice hot noodles or rice but today we're not going to use that we're not cooking noodles or rice we're just eating this this is just we're just having it just like this that's the way hey look at my shrimp look how beautiful that is Ooh, nice pretty red color um, and what I'm going to do next I'm going to keep the crap out of my cat I'm just kidding a little parsley in there for color. It makes everything <laughs> so much prettier. Toss it in there. 
and I'm going to give it a stir. And then we're just going to plate this baby up. Look at that, how pretty that is. Mm, yummy. You can even toss this over a salad. Shrimp, nice shrimp salad. Or some shrimp tacos. Yummy. All right. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to plate this up. Look at that. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Yummy. Did I ever get that garlic? I'm going to go ahead and throw my little bits in there on top. That is so pretty. Look how pretty that is. And then I am going to taste one. Look at that, look at that juice in there. Look at that, oh my goodness gracious. Dip that baby in there. That's smoking hot, ooh, that's some hot. Try it. Mmm. About drop the tail. That is delicious. Absolutely amazing. I hope you give this a try and give me a thumbs up. Tell me how much you love it. Um, subscribe so you can be sure to get all my latest videos. I've got a lot of them coming today. Um, follow me on Facebook, Pinterest, Google Plus, and um, there's one more. Twitter. What's the other one? Twitter. Twitter. That's right. Follow me on Twitter. And I will see you next time. Bye.